You'll, you won't guess where we're at right now. We are going after the wolf. It's whoop. time. Yee. It's time. Yes. Well, all year. All I'm waiting for. All year for this moment. For this one moment. Ben's not here yet. Ben comes tonight. Ben, but, uh, we kicked him out again. <laughs> but Mike and I are both here and we are hungry for elk. So we are going to go get a hunt in before dark. Uh, but like I said, we just got here. Ben will be here in a little bit. But we're going to have a whole lot of stuff coming this week. We're here for a week. Anyway, stay tuned. And uh, we're hoping to have an elk on the ground tonight. Keep it real. Well, guys, we, uh, we got our first bull spotted. He's about 12 inches long total. Comes out real, real good, like basket, you know. Maybe he's 14. His beams are huge. What do you think? Mike's not amused by him, I guess. I think it's a great bull. I don't think it's legal, though. So we're going to give up. He's running up the hill. Yeah, we're going to let this one go, but uh, here's some good video of him. much besides that spike and that cow so right now everything's pretty dry and it's really hot and there's elk that are there's elk that are hidden in this water down here I brought a trail camera so we're gonna set up a camera on that water and see if anything comes in tonight so I just bought my tag in Grand Junction, Colorado, and we are headed a couple more hours to find the bulls. I got the GPS coordinates, got the scout to hunt waypoint for the house, and we're headed there now. This is called the Sienna Hill Climb, all right? I was told, told these roads would be paved. Good morning, fellas, everybody. Up, we so, finally made it here to Colorado. The crew is all together. We have not been like all in the same spot since Texas, really. But we're stoked to be here and chasing some bulls. Uh, it is September the 6th. 6th. Wow. So the elk should be starting to pick up and run a little bit. We're staying at this freaking sweet cabin. And we're gonna go see if we can get into some bulls this morning. What's your guys' expectation for the day? Kill a giant? Like to see a legal bull. Okay, I'll see a legal bull. Yeah, all right. That'd be cool. If I see a legal bull, I'll kill a legal bull. <laughs> That's what we're gonna do with the monster cracked open. Let's go kill some elk. seeing deer then uh, that's that, that means we're looking small enough so you should be able to look see for the elk. big yellow thing the bus. big yellow thing <laughs> big yellow one is the elk Right there. It's pretty iced up. Yeah, <laughs> yeah it's way too cold out here. A cow elk. Good job, everybody. We did it. Found we did it. We found an elk. She dead.
doing a little test after we arrived so far. Everybody's shooting really good. Um, all killing elk, I think. Right there is going to be about 45 yards. Oh. See what we do? The smaller circles. Oh, he's not playing games, huh? Guess not. What's the range here? 53. 53? 53. 53. Oh, crap. I actually released when it was on the left side of it, which I probably shouldn't have done that. Ooh, nice. This is a great looking shot. Center punch. Dude, good I love shot. how quiet that bow is, dude. That bow is freaking silent. I can't shoot my bow with my So we came to this piece um, of property and uh, we didn't glass any elk this morning. There was one cow that came down and hit the trail camera last night, but we do have another piece of private that we can hunt. It's about 45 minutes away from here. So we're going to go give it a check. If it's not producing, we're just going to go to the public. There's a ton of public land um, up above us here and all around really. So our goal and our kind of plan strategy for this whole thing was just to check out the public, see how it is. If it's no bueno, uh, or sorry, check out the private, see how it is. If it's not great, then we go to the public. so dang hot we thought we'd just throw up a Hail Mary and see if one of these bulls come into water. So Mike and Ben are going to go glass a different point. We came and made a loop around this water. There's been tons of moo cows on it. There's definitely elk tracks there. And there was a bull elk track that walked down the road right there. So we're going to try to set up. We're not very well covered up. We'd be better off in a ground blind but hopefully we can see them coming or hear them coming. Kind of get set up and make a play. Probably a low odds of success, but you never know. Sit in water like this time of year can be very, very effective. So. Ben and Rocky are sitting in water right now. And Mike and I are up on this boy. check our glass game and see if we could turn up some elk. Uh, there's definitely some elk sign in here. Uh, so that's good. We know they're here somewhere. And we're just hoping to turn something up with enough time to move in. So we're going to set up right here. Okay, so it is actually September. The elk do rut in September. And we have just spotted a cow elk. So that could be really good. I think it might be like a year old calf. So there's a good chance that there's more cows with her. There's gonna be a big old herd bull, six by six, maybe 250 inches. And I'm gonna smoke it. <laughs> That's a good game plan, yeah. Little update, we got two more cows that popped out. You see right there? So they came out of the left side, right out of those trees. But uh, hopefully there's a herd bull with them. Still got plenty of sunlight. If a bull does step out, we got plenty of sunlight to make a move. She's looking back. Yeah, there's there's gotta be more elk in there. Sweet sunset. As luck would have it, there wasn't a bull with those cows. Um, so we're gonna work this. 
this uh, ridge down and uh, glass as we go. Kind of last little afternoon activity. See if we can turn something up. The tag that we have is either sex and a legal bull is four on one side. So, not being too picky, but not going after cows just yet. Called in a spike almost, but he caught our wind. Okay. He was coming on up. And then, and like right at dark, I I was throwing bugles out, just trying to see if we can hear anything. I throw my glass up, and about a mile away, I see this bull. I could tell it's a bull just because of his body and his neck and face, but I couldn't see how. how, how it was so total, we saw five. <laughs> <laughs> 